Happy New Year everyone, it's Kevin the Mac Expert here with a video for you, an unboxing of Aperture 3. So Aperture 3 is an amazing and ultimate extended and expanded version of iPhoto and it has many new features uh, which aren't available in iPhoto and it's a very powerful piece of software and I'm excited to be able to use it. Uh, according to the box, it's powerful photo editing and management and let's take a look at the back. It's powerful yet easy to use, and Aperture 3 combines pro performance with iPhoto simplicity. So some of the new features in Aperture 3 are faces, which allow you to organize your pictures by the people that you are taking the pictures of, or you can organize your photos by places, and if your camera has a GPS in it, and it'll tag the pictures, or you can manually organize them to where you took the pictures of. And that's a feature that we saw in iPhoto 09, but it's a nice update to have in Aperture now. In addition, Aperture 3 also has a couple new features such as presets. So if you have a bunch of pictures of a sunset and you want to change that, you want to up the exposure or lower the exposure, you can do that in every one uh, just by saving it as a preset. Another feature of Aperture is brushes, a feature which I'm not familiar yet with, uh, but it allows you to have special adjustments to your picture, specifically to pictures of people. And also, Aperture 3 allows you to make advanced slideshows, as it shows right here. But the advanced slideshows, you can add photos and video, and then export it in 1080p, in 720p, or you can export it to iPod format or DVD format, and it'll make a great slideshow. So let's go ahead and open up the box. And then you'll just slide out. Designed by Apple in California. An all too familiar logo. And we have the Aperture 3 install DVD. And on the inside, there's a little book icon, and that's where the documentation is. And as part of the documentation, you get an Aperture 3 installing your software guide, which is probably the most important. Uh, before you can use Aperture 3, you need a guide, to, you need a guide uh, so you can open it up. And next we have a little guide about improving your photos or specifically improving them with Aperture. So that should be interesting. Here we have the full manual exploring Aperture. And the last, we have keyboard shortcuts, uh, which is great. I'm actually, I'm happy they included this, which will, which will be great. And here's a sample page of Aperture. But anyway, I'm very excited to get to use Aperture, and I'm extremely excited because it's a wonderful uh, software from what I've heard, and it's very powerful photo editing. And to have your libraries and HD slideshows and presets and everything makes it uh, great software and great, great photo editing software. So I'm very excited about Aperture 3. Thanks for watching this video. Happy New Year, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.